What up guys, it's your girl Manic Meeks and I am back with more Umbrella Academy. And if you're enjoying the series or anything else I got on my channel, go ahead and subscribe, baby. I'm here, you're here, let's be here together. And I am still shocked and shooketh from the last episode. I cannot believe Vanya did that to Allison. I cannot believe it. I can't believe it. I can't. And all of this for what? What is his whole purpose? If the world is destroyed, isn't he destroyed too? Or unless he's a part of the commission? I'm so confused. <sighs> I'm so confused. And now I'm wondering what the guys are going to do. Because as of right now, all the ladies are out. All the ladies are out. And it's just down to the four of them. <sighs> okay. Okay. And I'm also hoping hoping that Hazel joins them and tries to stop the apocalypse and they get rid of Cha-Cha. As much as I love Mary J. Blige in real life, no real love. Uh, fuck that bitch in the show. Mm -mm. Fuck that bitch. Mm -mm. Real love. Ain't nobody fuck with you, bitch. Nope. 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 I don't want it to be no part of none of this, none yet. I want you to go away and let Hazel and Agnes enjoy their time together because they deserve it. Because you're worth it. Girl. She worked all her life. All her life she had to fight. Oh man, I don't even have anything else to say. I'm just going to go ahead and get started with this. This is The Umbrella Academy Season 1, Episode 9, Changes. Better eat that oatmeal before it gets cold. Yeah, that should freak your ass out, ain't it? There was nothing left. Oh, I, I just need to get to the men I to explain it to them. Alright, see? Fucking crazy people. Can you please dunk her hand in that water, please? That is not how you clean off blood. Can you dip? Can you dip it, please? Jesus, you're just spreading the blood, sir. Can you dunk yourself in some water? Say like, again. dunk. Can you please put that rag? Jesus. She suffered a severe laceration to her larynx. One of you will need to be blood. I will. I will. I'm doing it. I'm afraid that's not possible, dear boy. Your blood is more complex. Damn. I'll do it. Mm. Needles either. Looking for drugs? Don't do it. Indeed. You knew it too. Mm hmm. Don't take the pills. You're right. Let's get up. <laughs> Make me. Woo! I'm gonna get a little exercise. Gonna hurt. Gonna hurt. Yeah. <laughs> uh oh. But I've never been afraid of you. You about to be, son. Please, Jesus. Don't Ever fall for this. Your brothers and your sister, they went along with him every step of the way. What did you do? I did this for you. Stay away from me. You were not in danger. You just needed your Girl. own to see what they really are. I'm going to need you to get going. And I love them. Oh, he about to be pissed. You about to get hit in the face of the book. Or you about stronger. to get hit in the face with a book. You about to catch this book. And now I know it. Oh! 
Oh shit, bitch. He got a little bit. He got a little. He got a little knife in there. Boy, a free upgrade at the Rainquill Beauty next door for the purchase of our premium atrium pass. Girl, what the fuck are you falling over? Damn. It hurts, doesn't it? As much as I like you. I understand the anger, but, oh my God, his sad face. God damn fucking monkey. Oh. She really is one person I love with all my heart. Oh. Hopper, I'm gonna need you to suck it, suck it together. Suck, suck the shit in. I'm not crying. There'll be no tears. Oh, so, so Johnson sorry. Johnson shampoo. No tears. Fucking me after all. So why are you here? Well, I <laughs> <Ego's tough. laughs> <laughs> You know, before you kill him, you might want to hear the ass off and say, I draw the line of fighting. <laughs> he said he drew the so line of fighting. Say, I suggest you make it quick. She believed in people. Shit and filth she saw on the streets. I'm sure she'll be proud to know that you're killing Hazel and Josh as a way to honor her memory. Got a point. When you got a point, you got a point. Don't say anything stupid, Luther. I can see that. What are you finna do? Dude! Fucking Lupo! Like, Luther! Why would you do that? Yes. Try to kill the most emotionally unstable person in the house. It's cool. Choke her out. It's cool. It's great. This is the wrong thing to do. Allison, what are you doing down here? You should be in bed. I can't do that. She hurt you. I'm sorry, but you stay put. Luther's an idiot. Come on, let's go. Oh. Oh, it's doubly sucks. <laughs> This was the a wrong move. Let her go. Okay. You can kill me however you want. Oh, I intend to do that as well. Please stop using the table as fight leverage. Girl, if you don't rock your ass off that table, quit fucking hitting the table. Lady. Can you rock your ass off that table, bitch? Can you rock the fuck off that table, bitch? Go to the left or to the right. Jesus Christ. She's not fucking with you, man. Don't touch me. Don't touch me, bitch. That's right. That's my sister. Don't touch me, bitch. She likes secrets. <laughs> Her face is my face. I wish somebody would have came up to me in the store and said that shit. I'd been like, no. You gotta be tired of crying. They're still afraid of us. They fear you now. They're gonna keep you in here forever. This is why that was the wrong move. Because shit like this. Like. Losing her fucking shit. Staring at these gray walls hour after hour. Check the time, like what? <laughs> it's 
So you turned her into a super fucking villain. Great. 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 Tony the fucking tiger. Great. This is why Luther should not have been like. Oh. Granted, she is dangerous. I get that. She's definitely dangerous. She is unpredictable. Her powers are emotion driven and it's difficult to handle. However, you don't isolate someone who is having trouble controlling their emotions, especially when their emotions drive their power. Like that was the stupidest thing he could have done, especially everybody else is like, just let her out, give her a chance to calm down so we can talk about this and figure out what to do, which would have been the smart thing to do. And now I'm wondering what the hell the commission is going to do with Cha-Cha and Hazel. And I'm surprised she lived and all she has was a scratch on the chin. That's it. And like maybe some scratches on her leg. He threw that grenade underneath her skirt. Pretty much. It rolled by her damn feet. And that's all she has. I'm going to need some mechanical appendages or something. But... Man, I'm not sure. I, I have no... This is the final episode. Next episode is the final episode. And I can tell you right now that I have no clue as to what to even expect from this final episode. They're going to have to stop her because I think she causes the apocalypse. She causes it. Like, she'll explode that shit outwards. I think that's what she did. But yeah. And I'm glad Allison's alive. I'm glad. And the fact that she's not even mad at her sister. She said that she had scared her. She knew. It. She didn't know. But hindsight is twenty twenty. So now she knows how precarious her sister is. And how she should have been a little more delicate with telling her the information. And understanding and listening to her. Don't push her. She's literally a child. She has. She's literally learning how to handle her powers as an adult. Everybody else has had years to work with it. The only person who's in worse shape is freaking Klaus because Ben punched him. And he's like, how the fuck do I do this again? So he's trying to figure out the other half and she's trying to figure out hers. I'm just like, I just... my gosh, my gosh, my gosh, it's such a good show, such a good show. And on that note, I can't wait to watch episode 10. So I will catch you guys in the next video.